Hey, JB here with another video for you, and uh, it is snowing again, so uh, that's fun. But yeah, I am at the brick kiln, and I uh, got something I'm going to work on tonight that's a little different from what I've been working on. Uh, it's not going to be minifigure stuff tonight or uploading bricks, but uh, at my day job, I'm an electrician. I was working on a kitchen remodel job this week and I got this piece of blue countertop that is gloriously uh, 90s I think that I am going to take and put over here on top of these two filing cabinets and make a sorting station for starting to s kill this backlog of used um, something that's kind of funny is i actually just got these three containers here this one all this container had in it was these beads um my sister messaged me and said hey they got three bins of lego for sale up here for 15 dollars and so i paid 15 dollars to get these three bins uh this was in one of them which is very yellowed so i might be using this to build a uh, bag organizer for the, the little Ziploc bags for picking orders. But um, yeah, most of the stuff that's in here is not really going to be super useful. It's a bunch of just standard bricks. A lot of them are discolored. So not going to be too much value here. Uh, I didn't really look through it too much yet, but it looks like it's almost exclusively just standard bricks. There's a couple plants and some friends stuff, but uh, while my niece and nephew, oh look, there's a, what's that, Kristoff, get that out of there. But yeah, um, while my cousin, not my cousin, my nephew, niece and nephew are in town visiting from New York, uh, I let them pick some stuff out from these, from some of these bins and some of the unsorted stuff as a Christmas present. And most of the friend stuff that was in there went <laughs> as that, so uh, not really a big deal. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and move that countertop over here. Um, it's part of my uh, soda can collection. Some weird Mountain Dew stuff, some Norwegian Surge, and discontinued flavors and stuff of Mountain Dew. And so I need to do something with that finally moved it out of my daughter's room and I'm gonna find something to do with it. Uh, something else that I'm probably gonna try and work on tonight if I have time is I'm gonna try and fix that sag. Uh, what I'm actually going to do is I'm gonna put a board on the bottom shelf down here, put the jack on that board, um, Put another board at the top and jack it up till it's level and then cut a two by four to fit in between those boards as a support and see if that works that's that's my my plan and we'll see how how that goes uh, but for now i'm going to go move that countertop all right so i went uh before i uh Move this countertop. I went ahead and moved my um, balk used over here. Set up these tables to put it up on there. Um, I still have a bunch down here too, but I wanted to try and neaten things up. I moved the uh, minifigure shelf over there. Straightened up underneath this countertop some. And I put uh, the last bottom section I had of this uh, black shelving, I went ahead and put it there coming out. Like, if I if I ever get more of that shelving, I can come out this way. I never did jack up that shelf. I'm not going to get to that tonight because it's 9 o'clock and I still have to pack orders. And I'm going to go ahead and move the countertop now. <laughs> I'm going to actually do that now. All right, it is in place. And it's like just about the perfect height. So if I sit down in this chair and come over here, I fit right underneath there. So just cleaned it off some 
I don't have any actual cleaner here, so I just used some rubbing alcohol and a paper towel. But now, while I cannot really see wanting this color or type of countertop in my kitchen, I think this will make a decent background for sorting out Lego because it's not too similar to any of the Lego colors. So everything should stand out, get good contrast on it. And it's a good texture for pieces because I mean, it's countertop, so pretty good. So I'm going to have sorting stuff there. Um, I'll put all my cups along the back and maybe some on the side. And then I can sort, dump stuff out onto the, the front there or put a container there and sort into the cups. And I can do it either in the chair or standing up. So I'm looking forward to actually finally getting this stuff knocked out. Because some of the stuff has been here for a very long time. Oh, I forgot that this is not just standard bulk used. This is old castle stuff very dirty nasty stuff but some very good pieces in there uh, you can tell what set it is from that but yeah uh, so I guess that's gonna probably be the end of this video tonight so thanks for watching I'll spare you my dirty face because I came from work and have not gotten cleaned up yet so i'm looking pretty pretty bad tonight so i'm gonna end the video here thanks for watching and until next time y'all have a good one